Imagine being able to build full stack apps with AI and instantly share them with a massive community of creators, just like you who are vibe coders. You can see what others are building, try their projects, get inspired, and even remix their code into your own projects, all in this tool called Yourware. Stick with me, because by the end of this video, you'll not only know exactly how this tool works, but you'll be ready to create your own app from scratch and share them with the world for free. What is Yourware? Yourware is a free AI-powered tool that lets you build full websites or even web games just by typing what you want and absolutely no coding skills needed. We're going to explore how this tool actually works, and trust me, this is the best AI-powered web coding community I've ever seen. Once you click the link in the description, you'll land on this page thousands of people are creating and sharing their projects here. As you scroll down, you'll see endless examples of what people are building. Some people have made their projects public and others are not willing to share them with the public. For example, this one built this app where you upload your face and it transforms into a cartoon style. That's just one of many creative apps people share publicly for others to try. The best part? Every project is interactive. For example, let's click on another project to see what it does. Here's a 3D app for viewing museum images. The level of detail here is amazing. You can pan, zoom, and explore like you're actually in a museum. I have found this guy building a piano app. Let me just preview it real quick. If I click on the full screen icon, you can see the app much better. So yeah, this is an AI powered interactive piano. It's not just a basic piano, it actually helps you play. As you can see, it has a song generator where you can choose or even prompt a song, and then the AI plays it for you. For example, I'll pick this one called Jingle Bells. I'll hit play, and there you go, the AI is playing. You can even pause it and see how it works. What's really cool is that you can also practice by yourself. It highlights the keys you should press, and you just follow along. I don't really know how to play piano, but even I can follow this since it guides you step by step. There are also more settings here. You can upload an image, change visuals, or play around to make it match your style. Overall, this is a really great example of how you can use AI inside your apps. Now let's check out another fun example, a match three cookies game. You swap cookies to match identical ones, just like popular mobile puzzle games. This project already has many views and comments from the community. That's another benefit you can get real feedback on your creations. This is what makes this platform so powerful. It's not just a coding environment. It's a place where you can share, get inspired, and see exactly how other people are solving problems or designing their interfaces. There are also many projects. When you scroll, you can see a lot of projects. This guy has built a Ghibli image generator, and you can upload your image here and then generate a Ghibli style image like others are doing. So it has integrated GPT-4, which helps you generate images this one has built a budget tracker. It is very good. So you can see that Yourware is very good at designing front end and back end. So when you are here, I'm gonna show you how to get started. Let's build our own app. Come over here and click on this create button. Here's where we can start building with AI. We start by just giving AI a prompt or upload an image. You can also upload a file or folder of your project. For example, when you want AI to continue working on your project you already have. It can be an HTML file or CSS or JavaScript. So when you get code, you can paste it here, whether it's HTML or TypeScript. Let me try it out. I'll upload a file of a game I generated with Claude. This one's a checkers game. Once it's uploaded, the platform instantly gives me a live project. And here's the cool part. It also generates a shareable URL. So now I can open that URL in a new tab, preview the game in full screen, or just play it directly. It's smooth, and once it's uploaded, it stays here on the platform. We can even see stats like how many views your project has. And there's a comment section so people in the community can leave feedback. That's huge because a lot of people build projects but don't have an easy way to share them. This solves that problem. Just upload, get a URL, and share it anywhere. Now, there's also a feature called Boost. If I click on Boost for my project, the platform analyzes it, takes screenshots, and automatically improves the design. Basically, it optimizes the UI design so the project looks cleaner. Let's compare. Here's the original version, simple, works fine, but kind of basic. Now here's the boosted version. Right away, you can see it looks better. And it even added new features like game history and win tracking that weren't there before. So yeah, boost doesn't just make your project look nicer. It actually enhances it. And you can do this with any project you upload. That's a really powerful feature. So now let me go back and create a new project. Earlier, I showed you how to upload a file, but you can also just paste your own code right here and run it 
same as if you had uploaded it. And of course, you can also prompt the AI to build something for you. Plus, there are built-in tools you can use. If you click the plus icon, you'll see a whole list of integrations. This platform supports a lot of integrations, MCP like Supabase and many others that help you add backends, databases, and extra features to your apps. For this demo, I'll build something simple. I'll just ask it to create a landing page for my web design agency. Right away, it suggests some text to make the prompt better, hit tab to accept, and then click send to confirm the prompt. And just like that, the AI begins working. Now, as you can see, it's starting to write code for us and set up the environment. While it works, you can even chat with it or add MCP tools directly inside the chat. Everything is integrated. And by the way, if you wanna try this out yourself, I'll leave a link in the description. It's easy to get started since you get free credits every single day. So right now, it's planning out the tasks. That's what I really like about this. It doesn't just throw code at you. It actually gives you a clear to-do list of steps it will follow to build the app. And now it's done. It has finished creating my design agency landing page. And wow, it looks great. The UI is clean, professional, and smooth. When I expand the view, you can see the layout more clearly with background effects and nice animations. Scrolling down, it looks even better. It feels professional with 3D effects built into the page. Navigation is smooth too. When I click on a page link, everything loads seamlessly. So this is honestly amazing. I'm actually surprised at how good this build turned out. Everything you're seeing here was created with just that one single prompt. You can see that it's also good at building 3D apps. And once it's built, sharing is effortless. Just one click and boom, you can publish it, send the link, and anyone can view it. And look at this, it's super responsive. On desktop, it looks professional, but even on mobile, it adapts perfectly. The layout shifts beautifully, everything scales, and the animations still look clean. Honestly, it feels like something that was custom coded by a pro. And of course, if I wanna tweak something, I can. I can literally just tell the AI, change this or click this boost button and instantly upgrade the design. The boost feature takes the same app, reworks the UI, and gives it an even more polished style. Now, here's a lifesaver. Sometimes you'll spot a few errors. That happens, right? But with this tool, fixing them is as easy as clicking a button. You just hit fix and it immediately scans, detects the issues and starts correcting them for you. So yeah, building and improving apps with this AI is not only powerful, it's ridiculously easy. So whatever I wanna add or remove, I can literally just tell the AI. For example, if I wanna change something inside my app, I have different tools available right here. And the cool part is I can even attach images. Let's say I wanna take a screenshot of a section I don't like, or maybe highlight something I want fixed. I just take a screenshot, attach the image, and the AI instantly understands what I mean. When you get an error, it fix it for you. It will detect an error and show it to you, and when you click on the fix it button, it will go ahead and fix it for you. But here's something that really surprised me. This tool doesn't just stop at the front end. It actually has backend integration built in. For example, when I click this database icon, I can set up my project to collect and manage user data, things like emails, form submissions, or any kind of info users type in. And all of that data shows up neatly in a table right inside the platform. So let's come here and tell the AI to integrate a database into this form so I can collect user information directly on my website. For example, I can set it up to store emails, passwords, or any other data that users submit. There is also a select tool, which helps you to change any element in your website. Just click on select, choose the element you wanna update, and the AI will make the changes for you. Let us integrate the database. I'll click on the send button, and the AI will start working on the app. It doesn't take long. Now it's asking me to enable backend support. I'll open the MCP marketplace to enable the backend integration. After enabling it, the backend is successfully installed. From here, I can tell the AI to integrate it with my form. Once that's done, any data users enter in the form will be saved in the backend, and I can view everything directly from the database section. The AI also detects that the backend is enabled and starts integrating the contact form automatically. While it works, the AI creates a step-by-step -step plan for itself, which helps it complete the process quickly. You can see it writing code and setting up the form. You can even integrate Supabase if you want to get data in your own Supabase, and you can build your own dashboard where you can see all information users entered. Now it is finished, let's test it by entering some data, a name, email, subject, and message, and click send. When I refresh the database view, I can see all the information saved. The name, email, subject, and message are right there in the table. This shows the database integration works as expected. After everything is set up, I can publish the app by clicking the Publish button. 
Once published, I get a URL that I can share or open in a new tab to preview the app. Users can submit data through the form and track all in the database. This is another cool thing. When you share your project to friends and sign up, you earn credits on your account. When you still want to change things in your project even when it's published, you can do that. Another useful feature is downloading my code. I can get all my project files and data saved locally. This gives me full access and control over my projects. The platform also gives daily tokens. For example, here I can claim 100 free tokens just by clicking claim, and they are instantly added to my account. Now in two minutes remaining of this video, let's try building another project. The ones we made earlier didn't use AI, but this time let's build an AI powered application. I'll ask it to create an anime style AI image generator. Once I click send, the platform checks if the AI app tool is enabled and then gives itself tasks to complete. It says it will build an anime style generator. And after a few minutes, the app is ready. The app has options like hair color, eye color, and background settings. I can customize them and then click generate to create an anime character. For example, I tried a simple prompt like anime warrior with a cape and it generated the image instantly. I can also download the image to my device. If I change the prompt, for example, young anime fighter at school, the app updates and generates a new anime character with the chosen background. This shows how responsive and flexible the platform is for AI powered apps. Once the app is ready, I can publish it, share the link in full screen and let other people try it. Everything works across all devices and it looks professional. Another feature I found is that you can integrate this platform into your IDE. You can install your Wear plugin in VS Code or Cursor and use it directly in your coding environment. Overall, this is a very powerful platform for building full stack applications, whether with or without AI. You get free credits every day, 100 credits daily, plus 500 when you sign up. That's enough to build, test, and share apps. So if you want to try it, just use the link in the description to sign up and start building your own apps. If you are new here, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We share videos about AI and how to build apps without needing to code. Thank you for watching.